American pit bull terriers. They are the most important animal on earth. It is extremely loud every time someone comes over. Your dogs are your best friends. There's no love stronger than a dog's love. Your dog's not your fucking pet. Your dog's your fucking boy. Your dog won't cheat on you like your fucking old lady will. Won't take money out of your wallet. Won't fight to the fucking death to protect your fucking ass. Right. Even if it's your fault. Even if it's your fault. (laughs) Yeah, exactly. Your dog will damn sure help you bury a motherfucking body. Yeah. Dig a hole. Dig a hole. (laughs) Dig a hole. (laughs) Awesome. All right. Let it dry a little bit. I fucking hate these parties, dude. What? I have a lot more money now. In my life, I I feel that I am the underdog, and I think tattooed people are. Okay. How are you doing, Boo? Gotta keep it straight. Are you a tattoo? Way out of hand. I'm constantly judged on the basis of, of my appearance or my lifestyle. Breakfast are champions. <laughs> it's a stereotype. I just keep him around in case we, we run into Michael Vick. <laughs> <laughs> I definitely get some really bad looks. Oh, you're not drinking? No. I get mothers that won't let their kids play with my son because I'm obviously tattooed and then they find out that I've got pit bulls at home. Look at that. <laughs> it's a demonized breed, just like tattoo artists. Who did that? Two more? Oh, you're a bad motherfucker, blue hair boy. I go to church every Sunday. My pastor mentioned the Twisted Sister Christmas in the service. And a lot of people see me as a tattoo artist and make assumptions about me that are incorrect. <laughs> Happy New Year! Happy New Year! And I think the same thing has happened with the pit bull as a breed. I think with pit bulls, they are based solely on their appearance and all the bullshit hype in the media. I can relate to them on a level that a lot of people might not be able to. Pitbull Terriers are the most loyal, loving, nurturing, amazing, kick-ass dogs in the history of Earth. People see me walking down the street, they all run and hide. You can't tell a book by its cover. That's what they're doing to the pit bulls. I used to take it personally, now I take it in stride. And a pit bull will lay down and die for you. I got nothing against no one, I wouldn't hurt a fly. A long time ago they used to call them nanny dogs because they would watch kids. But people seem to think I'm mean, and here's why, here's why. I'm a pit bull, a big brown red nosed pit bull. Pit bulls were never bred to be human aggressive. Pit bulls are not human aggressive. You have to torture a dog to get it to be human aggressive. The only reason that any dog is going to attack you is because it's afraid of you. It's a defense mechanism. You pour battery acid on me, I'm gonna fuck you up too. I got 